are you right-brained or left-brained? The answer is, you are neither. That myth started in the 1960s when neurobiologist Roger Sperry conducted experiments with permission on epilepsy patients, where he cut out the corpus callosum, the neural fibers connecting either hemisphere of the brain. But the thing is today, we know that both sides of the brain are connected. In fact, there's actually three areas of the brain that are used when it comes to creativity. The first is the attentional control network. That helps us to focus on different tasks. The second is the imagination network. That helps us to conjure up mental images from imagination and from memories of past events. Third is the attentional flexibility network. That helps us to monitor what's going on around us and it helps us to switch between the imagination network and the attentional control. So what does that mean for you? Well, you are creative, or at least you could be. Our brains are remarkably malleable and they can be trained or taught to be more artistic and more creative. That's where I come in. I specialize in teaching people who can't draw or aren't creative, how to be more creative, how to tap into that inner creativity and to express themselves artistically. I teach people who can't even draw a stick figure how to draw and paint with confidence any subject matter. Want to know how? Hit the link below.